I, one thing I would say about this conference, it was um, very, very, a lot of, it was overwhelming at the same time, but yeah, it was a lot of useful information, a lot of knowledge. At the same time, it was impactful in the way that I felt empowered to fill out what I can do in my community to help, what I can do with my mentoring group or with my students. Um, Cause there's a lot of information that we can share with our parents, with our students, and just help get the word out. More people be knowledgeable and more cognizant of what's going on. Um, um, for me, it was very life-changing. Um, I learned a lot of things that I didn't know previously, and I learned that I need to watch my surroundings and share the information I learned today with a parent or anyone just in general who I see is going on the wrong tracks or whatever, just to make sure that they're not ending up like some of the people we talked about today. I'm in this boy and he's in the game, but I don't know like what to do because I fell in love with him. And he said he's giving me money to get my nails done and my hair done. And he said I can get more money if I go with him and his phone book. And they're coming over here in a few minutes to come get me. I really enjoyed being here at the conference. Um, I work for a sexual violence resource center, so I'm familiar with sex trafficking. Um, me and my co-workers, well, my name is Sheila Farrar. And I'm Bethany Williams. Um, but it's always good to see programs like this for people in the community so they can become more educated about this issue and realize how serious it is and how it's happening close to home. It's not something that's always on a large scale, um, especially as it relates to people of color, black people in particular, and our black girls. Yeah, I was happy to be here, just like Sheila said. Um, unfortunately, in the CAC where we work, we see um, sex trafficking um, happens often within the family. So I think it's it's great when we have an opportunity to speak to the public about what sex trafficking looks like and how to report. So we're happy to be here. Yeah, I'm Sheila Farrar, and I'm a 